Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video where today Marco Funny Zombie has gone ahead and thrown us inside this very spooky map where we gotta go ahead and escape four different levels to be able to get back to our wonderful family. And the hardest thing is inside every single level there is loads and loads of different challenges but to be able to do this is gonna take a very long time. Thankfully, I think we should be okay knowing that we have all the knowledge that we can get to be able to hopefully do these challenges. But the really spooky thing is, is that along the way we need to go ahead and find quite a few hidden apples, which is going to take a very long time. But the great thing is, is that I think we should be able to do this in no time. But I have got an idea of where we should be looking because apparently they do hide everything in every single location. See, there's hidden barrels everywhere. But hopefully we should be able to do this without pretty much getting too challenged. Okay, I'm going to have to find in. See, hidden rooms. This is the only room where pictures hide everything. Pictures and item frames will never be needed or hide anything after this area. Some of them probably are breaking, so don't go whacking. Well, let's do this. I think we have to try to walk through one of these and hopefully it will lead to some sort of hidden chest at the back. Okay, let's keep on going. Almost there. Anything? Yes! <laughs> We're doing it! This is perfect! Having to sneak through pretty much pictures is a very unusual day for us. I didn't think we'd be doing anything like this today. Oh, maybe we've gone into the wrong room. Oh, I think I found it. This time is a lot better. Perfect. And uh, let's see. Let's keep going. Aha. Uh -huh. I think it's right here. And perfect. We found the first emerald. This is a great way of finding loads of things and hopefully getting out of this crazy first house. It's going to be very challenging, but I think we should be able to get there eventually. Well, let's make our way back and hopefully we should be able to beat this awfully hard challenge. Come on. Getting out is going to be as hard as everything else. Oh, and perfect. Huh. I thought we were going to be stuck in there for a very long time. Well, thankfully, we've gone ahead and found the first emerald. So having to find all the other ones might be another great challenge for us. So I'm assuming they're going to hide everything everywhere. Oh, something's just happened. Okay, let's keep on going. Hopefully, we can find out the next few challenges. So nothing in there. Nothing. Hi oh, there is something at the back. Okay, let's try and reach it. Aha, another apple. Perfect. So I'm so glad we're finally getting the hang of this. Well, I'm assuming everything's going to be hidden just like that. Let's see. Another apple. And perfect. And I'm pretty sure there's going to be so many more apples everywhere, which is going to be very challenging. Like, there we go. And let's see where else. I'm assuming we have to put something inside here that will open up this awesome door. Oh, a water holder. Of course. Okay, let's go around here. And I'm pretty much now looking for a crafting table. Oh, here we go. A crafting table. Perfect. I've got to do one two and then three and we should get three glass bottles and i'm assuming this should now go ahead and work but i'm hopefully finding out where the next few things are okay everything seems to be good in there let's go inside here and let's fill up these water bottles and perfect and then we should be able to put them right inside here yes i knew it i knew that would work okay put three emeralds into the middle slot of the chest to continue ah oh, so that's how we beat this level by finding three emeralds we've got two so now having to find the other two is going to be a bit of a challenge for us so i don't think it's in there i think we're all clear around here hmm there's gonna be another sort of challenge somewhere we just haven't seemed to be able to find it yet wait a second there's something definitely unusual about this bed because who would do that i knew it i've done that before to go ahead and hide my wonderful house so we've got two emeralds and perfect now to find the last one Okay, it's going to be very challenging, but I'm pretty sure we should be able to find it. Hopefully, we are looking in the right places. Now, where would you... Wait, where does this redstone leave? Ah, oh, there we go! Another emerald! Perfect! So, sadly, we haven't been able to find the 16 apples, but we have found the three emeralds to go ahead and move on to the next challenge. Ah, the first one was actually a lot harder than we expected. Well, let's do this. Yes, it worked! <laughs> that is so awesome! Okay, now let's look around for the next few items to hopefully leave this level and pretty much get out of here. Now, where would all these things lead to? Okay, it's going to be a very long time looking around, but I'm pretty much hoping we should be able to find the next few things. This one definitely goes upstairs and pretty much... Wait a second. I've seen something like this before. What we've got to do is follow the maze around and beat it to get to the next level. Ah, oh, I don't think they're as smart as they thought they were. Hopefully, this is a great way of completing this challenge and getting out of here. Perfect. And 
Ah, it was just an apple. I thought there was going to be something else. See, I knew that would happen. This door will open at the end of the level. Okay, let's keep on looking around. And hopefully in no time, we should be able to find all of these awesome stuff. Okay, I'm not really sure where to look right now. But I'm pretty much hoping there should be something down underneath beds. Or Oh, there we go. Ah, the third levers. Okay, I need to go ahead and read this. Third four levers up up down down okay i think that should be good i don't know what it means just yet but i'm pretty much sure we should be able to find it so nothing in there like last time oh here we go this is where it comes to third four levers up up down down okay so i'm gonna do up up down down and then i'm gonna do the same here up up down down up up down down and then the next one up up down down anything happen oh Guys, I, I heard something. Something definitely worked. Oh, wait a second. Did we somehow just beat that level super quick? Okay, that was very strange. Well, I'm pretty happy to be out of here. So it seems like now we're on the next level. And I'm not really sure what to do. We seem to be in some sort of place. Wait a second. I saw something. Can you guys see that? On the way in, I definitely saw something. I don't know. Maybe I was just out of my mind. Okay, I'm going to keep on looking around and hopefully we can figure out how to get out of this next one. This one definitely seems to be a lot more challenging than the last few. Everything's just made out of dirt, really confusing, and I'm not sure what to right click on or what maybe to place and what to get rid of. Gosh, we're even reaching dead ends now. Oh, I found a house. Perfect. Okay, let's go inside. Nothing in there. There's a hidden chest right under there. Hmm... Oh, and we found another apple. Perfect. Okay, let's keep on looking around. So far, I haven't been able to find anything. Hmm. Oh, what happened? Something happened outside. Let's press it again. Quickly. Oh, it's down there. Okay, I think I know exactly what to do. We've got to be quick. Okay, now that we know where the button is, getting out should be pretty easy. No, <laughs> we're not fast enough. Okay, there we go. And good. We get stuck on this awesome trap door. I've just had to go and turn off auto jump because that was making it a lot more challenging. Perfect. Nah, we almost made it. Come on. Last time and this should be good. And let's get back and perfect. Here we go. Let's do it this time. Perfect. Oh, okay. So we got a lever which must be placed on a redstone lamp. Let's click this button and good. And let's keep on roaming around and hopefully we can figure out what to do now. I think it might have something to do with whatever's down there. Oh, there we go. It's exactly down there. Okay, let's do this. Down we go. And perfect. Let's put it there. And good. Nothing happened. Oh, it opened the door. But I also saw there was a shulker box right here. Perfect. Okay, and there's another chest right here. Let's see what's inside. Ah, nothing. I thought for a second we found a hidden clue. Okay, I'm going to go inside this next room and let's see what it says. Hmm, three. Wait. I think this has to do with the flowers that are inside the room because I only saw red and then white and then blue flowers. Okay, let me just go and figure out how many flowers there were and I'll be back in a few seconds. Okay, I think I've got it. So it was uh, five red and then, oh, I can't see those. Uh, I think it must go down here then. Three and then it was uh, six of the other one, which I'm assuming six might be down there. Oh, no, 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 six is another one. Okay, there we go. And perfect, good. We're on to the last level. Perfect. Okay, I didn't think we'd even make it this far. I thought maybe it would be so challenged that we wouldn't be able to even complete this. Okay, for some reason, the path seems to lead down there. Can we right click? Ah, a diamond. <laughs> I, that was so random. Okay, let's keep on going. We're going to have to look inside every corner and hopefully find out where everything hidden is. Do you know what? So far, we found everything pretty easy. But there must be some more hidden challenges everywhere. Let's keep our eyes open. Oh, we found another diamond. Perfect. Do you know what? This one's been a lot easier to go ahead and find everything. So nothing. Oh, another diamond. So far, this has been actually really awesome. I wonder how many diamonds there are. And I'm also wondering if we can go ahead and keep them at the end. Okay, let's keep going. Nothing in there. Nothing I can seem to see down there. And this leads to a dead end. Oh, there's some stuff up here. Okay, nothing. Now, I am still looking around for how to beat this awesome challenge, but it seems like so far, it's definitely becoming a little bit harder. Wait a second. I think this has something to do with the map. It's a very unusual block to have around. Okay, let's keep on looking around and figure out if it has anything to do with this.
Now look at this. I found a golden apple right inside there. The only way I saw this is because I had my little view like this and I saw the button right behind it. Oh, that was so challenging. Okay, I'm going to have to keep on looking around and hopefully we can figure out where the next little challenge is because so far we're collecting all the little bonus points but we haven't seemed to be able to find where anything else is. Okay, I'm just collecting diamonds at this point because I don't know where else I'm supposed to be looking. But it seems like... Oh, room where you end the map. Enter whenever. Ah, oh, I should have known this. Okay, let's see. Don't put extra items into this chest while resetting. Place the right amount of powder in each slot. Don't put extra items into this chest while resetting. Oh, I see what he wants us to do. So he wants us to go ahead and take out every single one of these and go back around and count how many of these colorful blocks we saw. So I think it was uh, three of the green and then I saw that there was eight red, but then how many of all the other ones? Do you know what? I'm going to go and have to figure this out. Okay, it's taken me forever, but I think I finally got it. So it was definitely eight red. Okay, so we put them all in and perfect. And then orange was... Oh, six. Okay, let's do this. And perfect. And then the yellow should be right behind here. And I'm pretty sure it was all eight yellow. But if we get this wrong, thankfully we can reset it. And then the blue. Oh, no, we got the green. So I think this was five. So we have to be left with uh, two. And then the blue. So I've added the blue. And then I think it was four four of these pink ones and then finally it was six of these let's do this we did it guys we completed the map that is awesome so that is every single room we've been in and look from above it looks so easy but definitely when we were in there it was so challenging well, guys, that was pretty awesome, but I'm pretty scared that I don't want to even go in that map ever again. Do you know what? I'm just happy looking at it from above. Well, guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe down below, the button is red, and also don't forget to comment down below what you would have done in each of the maps. So, guys, I'll see you all soon. Peace out.